Hello, this is Bob from Native Instruments. In this video, we will show you how to determine if your third-party controller offers tractor-ready integration. We will also show you how to find and integrate a suitable tractor mapping in case it does not offer an advanced tractor integration. Tractor offers the integration of official tractor-ready mappings for certain third-party controller models. The integration allows you to quickly set up your controller via Tractor Setup Wizard. To find out if your controller is tractor ready, look up its manufacturer and model name in the corresponding list linked in the description of this video. If your controller is tractor ready, you may leave this tutorial and proceed with the configuration via the Setup Wizard as shown in the article How to Set Up a Third Party Tractor Ready Controller, likewise linked in the description of this video. If your MIDI controller does not offer tractor-ready integration, you will need to find a suitable mapping from online resources. There are several ways to obtain third-party controller mappings. A good starting point is to enter the name of your controller model, followed by tractor mapping in a web search. A look at the search results shows links to discussion threads and popular forums for DJs and producers. This is to be expected since most third-party mappings are created uploaded, and shared independently by users of these communities. Occasionally, you may also find a suitable mapping file in the website of your controller's manufacturer. We recommend to look into the online resources provided by Tractor Bible and DJ Tech Tools. Both platforms feature a dedicated section offering several MIDI mappings created by both users and experienced moderators, as well as tutorials, product reviews, and much more. Note that you must create a user account at DJ Tech Tools in order to download the mappings or submit a mapping request in the user forum. Please be aware that Native Instruments cannot guarantee for the correct functioning of unofficial controller mappings. In case you cannot find a suitable mapping for your third-party controller, you need to create or modify a mapping in Tractor's Controller Manager. For more information, please consult the video and article on the use of Controller Manager and MIDI mappings linked in the description of this video. A controller mapping in Tractor is a file with the extension .tsi. In most cases, the mapping you download is a compressed folder consisting of one or more .tsi files. If the mapping folder you downloaded consists of several .tsi files, read the instructions to find out what each of these mapping files does. The instructions are usually found either on the page where you downloaded the mapping or as an additional file within the same folder. Once you have downloaded and extracted the mapping file, you need to import it into Tractor. To do this, go to Preferences, Controller Manager. Make sure that your third-party controller is connected and recognized by your system. Then click Add below the Device field and select Import TSI, Import Other. Navigate to the location of the .tsi file, select it, and confirm with Open. Now the name of your controller mapping should appear in the device list. When you select it, you can see its commands in the assignment table below. Next, with the mapping still selected in the device list, make sure that the MIDI ports are correctly selected under Import and Out Port. The port must be uniquely associated with its controller, so avoid using the All Ports entry. Note that it is not necessary for the controller mapping to remain selected in the device menu. The controller will interact with the software at all times once the correct MIDI ports have been set. You can verify if the ports are set up correctly by turning a knob or pressing a button on your controller. The control indicator in Tractor's global section should light up in blue. If Tractor is not reacting to your controller or the MIDI port is not available, consult the article How to Monitor the Input of a MIDI Controller linked in the description of this video or contact the manufacturer to seek further assistance. 
Now your third-party controller mapping has been imported and configured correctly in Tractor. The software will react to its control movements according to the set of commands in the assignment table, which you can further modify if needed.